A clinic visit during the pandemic. Tanya Chung is not ill. She's here to have her first ever microplastic surgery. I want to have Botox along my jawline and hyaluronic acid fillers for my chin. I'm very happy and excited because I've been looking forward to this for a long time. I think I'll get prettier after the treatment. She says she's been longing for a face revamp for three years already, but could never take the time to do it. I'm in sales and I have to face clients every day at work. It would be very inconvenient to have bruises and swelling on my face after a treatment. Now that everyone wears a mask, I don't need to worry about that. So I am taking advantage of the pandemic. Plastic surgeon Xavier Hu says business dropped significantly at the beginning of the coronavirus pandemic, but things started to turn around in the second half of last year. Business has gone up by 50 percent. The increase is quite impressive. Many patients told me it's their first time having cosmetic surgery thanks to the face mask rule. As for my existing patients, they used to come here, say, every six months. Now they come every quarter. So people are coming in more often. Taiwan is one of East Asia's beauty hubs. There are more than 800 cosmetic clinics on the island with a population of 23 million. Of the 40,000-plus registered doctors, a quarter work in the cosmetic industry. Most clinics are located here on Zhongxiao East Road in Taipei. But doctors say demand is now so high that getting an appointment won't be easy, as long as the mask mandate is in place. During the pandemic, people are diving ever more deeply into social media. And because everyone naturally wants to look their best, the demand for plastic surgery has been driven up. Cosmetic surgery consultant Andrea Hong promotes treatments on Instagram. She noticed a drastic change after COVID. Before the pandemic, when I post an Instagram story, I usually only get 500 views. Now it's at least 1,000 to 2,000 views. I get more inquiries than I used to. I think people are more aware of how they look on social media, and they are desperate for a quick fix, so they come to get cosmetic treatment. And for many, getting treatment is not just about the look, but a way to find happiness during the pandemic. COVID has brought so many uncertainties to the world. At least I can control how I look. I feel good if I look good. It cheers me up and boosts my confidence. That joy is real to me.